We're going back quite a few years now, to New Year's Eve in 2009, to be exact. Danielle was visiting a friend in hospital and she bumped into John in the hospital cafe. As soon as they met, there was chemistry between them and there was an undeniable, definite spark. Realising this and not being one to let a good thing go, Danielle invited John back to her flat for a coffee and to meet her cats and well, he just never left. It's fair to say that it was love at first sight for these two, which sounds like something out of a fairy tale, which is very apt because Danielle does love a fairy tale. They both discovered that they had the shared love of cats. In fact, they now have eight cats together. It wasn't just the cats that they have in common though. They both love arts and crafts. And although they enjoy social events together with their families, they're really happiest when they're currying in and watching a movie together. They have had some great times when they've been out and about right enough. They enjoyed a trip to Esther Tea. They had a ball there. Even a mammoth 36 hour coach trip couldn't have put them off their holiday and it did need dull the sparkle that they had. That trip was even more special because Danielle's papa was there too and so they really did make some wonderful memories. John and Danielle have a wonderful dynamic together. They share the same sense of humour. Danielle gets her kicks by pranking John and jumping out and giving him frights and she gets them every single time. She loves making him jump and even though he tries to do the same back to her, he doesn't quite have the knack that Danielle does. They have great fun together. They make shaving foam beers and they generally just love making each other laugh. Their sense of humour isn't the only thing they love about each other though. I asked them if they could tell me what they loved about each other and John told me he loves the fact that Danielle loves him back. He loves her because she's beautiful and he knows that she would never hurt him and he trusts her implicitly. He loves how thoughtful and caring she is. There are lots of things that Danielle loves about John as well. She loves how he keeps her on her toes and how funny and bubbly he is. John is very loving to Danielle and she just loves being around him. I can see you in the meadow Holding out your hand And will you meet me there tomorrow Where the sunlight never sets 